Let's get you the latest from Battleground Karnataka and the Congress has filed a police complaint today against Union Home Minister Amit Shah in Bengaluru for making hateful and provocative uh, statements. They've also gone to the Election Commission. Now, Congress leaders Randeep Singh Surjewala and Parmeshwar and DK Shiv Kumar filed a complaint against BJP leader Amit Shah for allegedly making provocative statements promoting enmity and hatred and maligning the opposition. Addressing a rally in Karnataka's Belagavi district on the 25th of April on Tuesday, Home Minister Amit Shah had said that development in the state would be in reverse gear if the Congress forms government. He said uh, the corruption would hit uh, record levels. He said the, that Karnataka will see riots if the Congress wins. He said if the Congress comes to power, dynastic politics will be at an all-time high and Karnataka will be afflicted with riots. And it's over these comments that the Congress has now made this complaint. Union Home Minister has said that if Congress party comes to power, they'll be affected with communal rights. Congress party comes to power. He has said that if Congress party comes to power, it'll be affected with communal rights. How can he tell that? Why is he making uh, such type of statement? My ACC has already filed in the election commission. After, the, after filing only, we have come to the police station to look at this matter. The office of Home Minister of India is an office where Home Minister of India is supposed to protect harmony in the country, in across the states, and is supposed to defend law and order. If Home Minister of India makes fake false statements, instigate uh, statement, makes instigative statements that creates disharmony and possible conflict between classes, religions and communities, then who will protect law and order?